morning Facebook. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good afternoon, good evening. You might be somewhere else in the world logging on. I just wanted to say good morning to you all as I'm taking a later walk than usual. Um, I normally do this quite early in the morning and um, reconnect with the higher source. I give honour to God and uh, and normally there is a little bit of inspiration or motivation as I am on my walk. But today uh, is the last walk before I go back on contract. Um, working with uh, young people and women is pretty much a calling. And I just wanted to encourage somebody today um, to do your best. Do your best at what you do best right do your best at what you do best and um, I think sometimes we can get into this place where we follow the expectations of what other people put on us but I want to tell you today second day of September, the first Monday of the month of this new season because we are going into autumn. Um, I don't think it's officially not summer yet, but we know that when September hits, autumn hits. Um, So as we're going into this new season, do your best at what you do best that is my encouragement to you do your best at what you do best not what other people expect you to do Um, and sometimes it means that you may have to if you are a business owner like myself it means that you may have to hire someone to do the job that you don't do best because you need to focus on what you do best all right, so I hope that this is making sense to you because I'm using the same words to communicate this over to you, All right? So do, do your best at what you do best. So sometimes, for example, I know for me, what I do best is on the front line. What I do best is me... Um, speaking, what I do best is me singing, what I do best is me inspiring and contributing in that way, lifting people, caring for people. Administration is not something that I do best at. I can do it. But sending out emails and all of that, that, that to me is not what I do best. So sometimes what I'm saying is you may have to really bite the bullet and it may be the thing that excels you. It may be within your home. It may be within your business. It may be at work. It may be anywhere in your life. But you have to make a decision as to what you do best. Focus on that. And allow someone else to do the thing that you're struggling with in order for you to grow and excel and be the person that God has called you to be. And sometimes that's frightening because you think, oh, that means I have to trust somebody. That means I have to give, give over to, I have to give it over to someone, place, place something of that that you hold valuable in someone else's hands but this is where you have to learn to trust yourself first and we often think that it's about trusting other people that comes into it but the first the first part of it is you trusting yourself to make the right decision of the person that you are going to put in place. Does that make sense? So, do what you do best 
yeah do do that and leave the rest delegate give over to teach even so for instance within the home that you might be at work and it might be difficult your children may be older now uh you're going into a season where your children are older they get home but you're coming home from work and you're having to do everything you're you're coming in and you're you're putting pot on fire you're cooking for the family but you could train your child the word of god says train a child up in the way they should go and when they're old they will not depart from it you could train your child you could teach your child to cook even if it's basic spaghetti bolognese because it's going to be a help to you do you understand what i'm saying it doesn't have to always fall on you and this this word goes out to every walk of life so this is within your business within your home um at work you know you might find yourself at work and you're doing everything you're running yourself rugged at work trying to be this person trying to be the best but actually you could just delegate some stuff that's all it takes is giving it over and it's and it's trusting so my niece is trusting learning to trust yourself that you are giving over that part of the authority to somebody who is capable so that you can then focus on what you do best and so i just want to encourage you today to do your best at what you do best and that's it that's my word today you know as an inspired woman that's what i focus on doing my best at what i do best so this is your girl if i'm michelle very very short word i'm on my walk and this word is for me as well it's for me as well because i'm going back to do some more training today it's a training day and before i go back into session tomorrow to go and teach um so i'm training myself so that word is for me every word i give every single word i give every walking power that i do um every word i take for me first so trust yourself learn to trust yourself learn to trust yourself yeah because this is where we 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 oh this is where we come up with so much issues of oh i don't trust people I don't. but a lot of the time we're saying that we don't trust other people because we have no trust in ourselves in making the right decision and why is that because some of us have made really poor decisions we feel in relationships in things we've said in things we've done we've made really bad decisions and so when it comes to any decision we second start second guessing ourselves and think oh that might not be a right decision or no this person or we always project it outwardly <coughs> to say it's the other person but actually it's us right so start within yeah do your best at what you do best trust yourself all right this is your girl Yvonne Michelle I'm out ciao have a good day enjoy the sunshine ciao ciao